was nobody. Heck of a way to kick off a run for Los Angeles City Mayor. City Councilman Joe Buscaino was speaking to a crowd Monday morning on the Venice Boardwalk, highlighting one of his key issues, the homeless epidemic. Build more housing faster. He spoke for 10 minutes on the need to ban tents on sidewalks, in beaches and parks, calling them inhumane. Yeah. The crowd cheered and carried signs. The candidate was working the crowd when someone noticed a woman standing beside the candidate, drop the knife, drop the knife. holding a knife and yelling, I'm going to start killing people. Buscaino's security detail hustled him out. The video shows the homeless woman detained by the LAPD as cell phone video rolls. You can see the six inch blade drop to the ground as the woman says she needs that knife for protection. Ew, he loves touching me like this. The woman was arrested. An LAPD captain was injured during the arrest. Hours later, the councilman, who was not hurt, reflected on what had taken place. They said, knife, 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 and they hold me away. But clearly, she was not in the right mind frame. This is happening in every corner of the city of Los Angeles. It's not a crime to be homeless. Okay. We, we need to address the issue that we don't arrest people for being homeless. When they start pulling knives and when there are high crime areas within these dangerous encampments, there are criminal elements for those who are preying on our most vulnerable. Longtime residents along Ocean Park are outraged at the encampments that abound, the money that's spent, and no solutions. We've got more people moving to the beach without any support. And if they don't get the mental and physical support they need, it's going to get worse. On Sunday, less than 24 hours earlier, this man was attacked as he was performing on the boardwalk in Venice. Pictures show his bruises, just one of several recent high-profile incidents, a sign of the continued problems at one of Southern California's most famous beaches. That last victim, 61-year-old John Gavert, I just got off the phone with his sister, Lori. She told me that he spent 24 hours in the hospital, that he had a shattered cheekbone. She said that he likes to perform there on the boardwalk. He dances, although she said he doesn't dance very well. But so many people outraged by what they say was a homeless man who came along and socked him so hard with his fist that he had to spend 24 hours in the hospital. Laura Diaz reporting live from Venice. Now back to the studio, Chris and Mark.